Ugh, I'm just a ray of sunshine today. Jesus. Well, hello there, Collabomination. It's Tuesday and I'm not Hannah. I am very sorry about this. Personally, Hannah makes my Tuesdays perfect and fantastic, so I know how you feel. The human brain can only take so much awesome per week, and especially after Matt's video yesterday and all the wonderful videos to come for the rest of the week, if you add Hannah into the mix, your brains would just explode. So the Collabomination team sought to find someone to bring down the awesome levels for Tuesday to help you guys recover from Monday and prepare yourselves for the rest of the week. Or Hannah was on a trip and couldn't make a video. By the way, I can say your channel name now almost perfectly. I still can't type it though. It comes out always looking like the word dog. What am I supposed to say? There's a theme. There's a theme. Theme. This week's theme is controversial things. Now I have never made a video that was controversial before. Theft is controversial because it's illegal, but it's also fun. For instance, I stole this hat from my friend a few days ago and he hasn't realized that it's gone yet, so I'm just gonna keep it until he asks for it back and then I'm gonna make a sad face and give it back to him. There are some things that I've come across since I've been in college that kind of turned me into a giant squid of anger. There's a girl that I met since I've been up here that is friends with my roommate, but I never really cared for her that much. I overheard one of their conversations one day and something that she said really made me ah! She was talking about a sophomore boy that she was interested in. She found out that he was a virgin and immediately stopped her pursuit of him. In her book, he immediately lost all credit and it was a mark against his character. All of a sudden, he was a loser and not worth her time. Um, what? Don't get me wrong, I make judgments about people based on silly things all the time, but judging someone based on whether they've had sex or not is completely foreign to me. How can someone being a virgin reflect badly on their character? It just doesn't... It doesn't compute. Choosing to have sex is an important personal decision, and some people wish to wait to make that decision until later in life. Good for them. It's not anyone's business to judge them for it. In the words of the lovely Monday Matt, if the difference between having and not having sex with someone is one drunken night, how can you praise them for that? And it should be their business, not yours. Hand dryers. That's what I want to talk about next. I want to talk about that. Hand dryers. They're loud, they interrupt me when I'm filming, and I think I read an article one time about a study that they did saying that it gets your hands dirtier than if you never washed your hands at all. I'm googling it. I found it. After washing and drying hands with a warm air dryer, the total number of bacteria was found to increase on average on the finger pads by 194% and on the palms by 254%. Uh. In the beginning of the year, someone had the genius idea of putting a little sticky note on it that said, please do not use during quiet hours. Smiley face. And eventually someone took it down, so I put another one up, and they took it down again. And I think I'm gonna try a different tactic this time. I think I'm just gonna print out the study and tape it to the hand dryer so that people don't want to use it anymore. Yo, 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 collabomination. I will see you somewhere around the nation. And yeah. Hi. Hi. You just taking pictures of yourself? No, I'm doing a video for YouTube. Oh. Yeah, I I make the. <laughs> You're on YouTube. Yeah, wow. I make vlogs. Why aren't you on my theft prevention thing? Oh, theft is controversial because it's illegal, but it's also fun. <laughs> An awkward moment when your RA walks in on you making a video. Now all I need is a pair of overalls, and I just got it down.